All right, so today I am in the shed door. I have brought with me my friends, Cesar Villacorda and Vanessa. Both are herpers, and we're gonna be looking for a rare salamander called the shed door salamander, as well as other herps. Let's see what we find today. So Cesar was only a half hour late today, and Vanessa claims that's what? That's pretty good. That's pretty good? It's not late. What do you think? Pretty bad. <laughs> This is the little dude I want to find. The Shenandoah Salamander. Are you ready? I'm ready. We're going to find some salamanders. We're going to find some snakes. Let's do this. The Shenandoah Salamander only lives on three mountains in the entire world, and that's right here in Virginia. We are going to explore Hawksbill Mountain today. The Shenandoah salamander very much resembles the eastern redback salamander, and in a way, the eastern redback salamander is the Shenandoah salamander's nemesis, because both species compete for the same resources like food and habitat. So the first find of the day is, I'm in the light, let me see if we can put that in the light. This is a, a, a juvenile redback, it's not a Shenandoah, they look very similar. So we're going to keep looking. The eastern redback salamander is a much better competitor and more aggressive, and a reason why the rare Shenandoah's populations are limited to such a small range here in Virginia. Already hurt this one. Here we go. Found it. So we found, uh, we're finding a bunch of the red bags, which is leaving me a little concerned because it's going to be harder to find a Shenandoah. We're going to move higher in altitude. So Vanessa's really here for the shrooms, I think. All right, what what is this type? I'm not absolutely sure, but I think this is a Berkeley's polypore. Berkeley's polypore. I think it's massive. Put your hand over it. Get it. It's huge. Is that edible? You think? Yes, it's edible for sure. All right, she's a bloodhound on the trail. What do you got? What's the venture look like? Marbles. We're at the summit, but Vanessa's afraid of heights. Caesar, how are you with heights? You can do it. It's harder to hike there. Ah, you're doing good. I say that's pretty good. You got nine feet from the ledge. All right, so we're at the top of the mountain, but we did not find anything but eastern redbacks on the way up, so I really want to find a Shenandoah. Uh, I wouldn't mind finding a timber rattlesnake, but the reason we didn't find a Shenandoah is Caesar's fault, so we blame Caesar. He was late, that's why. Say it again. He was late. That's, that's why. why. Because he's late. Always late. Shame. Shame. Alright, let's go. Caesar, what you got? Lead back? Lead back, yeah. Of a red back? <laughs> the lead back morph of the red back. That's good work, sir. She's probably found 30 red backs by now. She's <laughs> looking at me. We're finding so many red backs. And we may have found a couple of Shenandoah. I admit, I should have done more research. Alright, put her back. We may not be finding a Shenandoah salamander, but at the same time, it's very rewarding just being out in the wilderness with friends. I grew up in the Rocky Mountains of Colorado, so being in a mountainous habitat always feels so 
pleasurable to me. The goal of this mission may have failed, but we are succeeding in so many other ways just by hiking and enjoying our natural world. We're, we we're leaving Caesar behind. We should have a cutoff. A cutoff of what? Like a time that we should not pa go past that. It's red back though. Sort of a yellow, more of a one. So we haven't found a Shenandoah, but we get a little consolation for us. That is the coolest thing ever. We found a slimy white spotted salamander, which is a good one. Settled down. So right where we found the slimy white, we also found a northern two line and an eastern red bay. As Vanessa called it, the Salamander Hotel. Nice. It was fast, that guy was hard to grab. So here we found a juvenile white spotted. Vanessa thinks this is what? The cutest? Alright, you're still in the Shenandoah. Oh, good day overall, right? Mm, I would say so. Herpin is always good stuff, especially in these beautiful woods. We're leaving here and uh, some people were stopped in front of us and then they left and we looked over and there was Bear mom with the babies. Check it out. Vanessa's very first bear. So it was a long, hard day of search, and I think we found, I don't know, like 50. Eastern redback salamanders, Vanessa found so many. But we added two new species to that uh, northern two line, and of course the slimy white spotted. You know, it's fun. Just get out with your friends, spread some knowledge, be nature.